guys what is up and welcome back it is your girl xx sim sim and we are here with a brand new video on the channel okay and today we are actually bringing you the very first episode of the 100 baby challenge with our sim guadalupe hiat and her man derek okay so this is them guys i'm so excited for you guys to get to meet them so before we get into the video please don't forget to stop right here and like this video comment down below what you want to see in this let's play something else you want to see in the channel or just anything you want to tell me and don't forget to subscribe for more hit that bell to be notified every single time that we post so let's go ahead and get right on into it so these are our sims okay these are our sims guadalupe hiat and we have our sim derek shaw okay they are so lovely so cute so you guys didn't learn the backstory in the kaz video because i wanted you guys to come up with the video and lucky enough we had a user comment down below a very great backstory for them okay i'm so thankful for all your guys' support shout out this user you guys are so sweet and so helpful and i love it okay so derek actually has work in a little bit he's going to be leaving in literally three minutes so while derek goes ahead and goes off to work i'm gonna go ahead and tell you the backstory for my girl guadalupe here okay so this is Miss Guadalupe. So Guadalupe's dad left her at a very young age. She didn't have a father figure when she was growing up, okay? And she wanted to have kids to give them a mother that would care for them. And that's kind of all she wanted to do in life was just, you know, ooh, as Miss Girl goes and throws up. So sorry about that. But she just wanted to give kids a really good mom because she had a really good mom. Okay, her mom was so good to her and her siblings. She never was rude or neglected them or anything like that. She really was just an amazing mom. And after she passed, she wanted to just kind of carry on that legacy and be a great mom as well. So when Guadalupe was young, she never really cared about finding a boyfriend or finding love or anything like that. It wasn't really, you know, on her mind, on her radar and stuff like that. But, you know, when she was working at a coffee shop, wow, around the time when people her age were in college, she didn't go to college, but around the time when people her age were in college, she, um... She was working at a coffee shop, and that's where she met Derek. Okay, so Derek instantly fell in love with her. He thought he, she was just the bee's knees, okay? He thought she was just the loveliest girl in the entire world, and he decided to move her into this big, beautiful family home. This is a four-bedroom home, if I believe correctly. Okay, so he decided to move her into this big beautiful home and that is where they live now so all Derek wants is he just wants a wife and a big family and he just wants to come home to his wife and his family every day that's really all he wants so that's Guadalupe was more than happy to oblige and as soon as they moved in she got pregnant so she is pregnant right now clearly Miss girl looks like she's going to pop also tell me what you guys thought about the intro video so I've learned how to use the sims 4 camera and so I've started making intro videos for my sim so let me guys let me know what you guys think about it but yeah so that is the backstory Derek of course comes from golden retriever family he had great parents that loved him and he just wants to have a good family he has a good job as you can tell he is currently a lieutenant colonel okay he makes $179 an hour works 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. so they they are good they are good guys so we are just going to be really he's just kind of doing his thing but we are going to be following the life of Miss Guadalupe here as she has all of these babies guys she's going to be so pregnant so pregnant and i'm thinking i also want to get them a pet because i know we can have eight sims and a lot but i think you know it's a four bedroom house so i think i want to keep four people at a time four sims at a time which i think is a good idea i don't want to get myself too overwhelmed yeah girl i know you stink but i've got to feed you too you've got a lot going on so we're gonna have her go ahead and eat that but i want to have four kids at a time because even that's gonna be a lot for me to manage so the fact that ooh, i made her eat meat and she's vegetarian she's gonna be mad yikes oh well now i know 
now I know, but you know, it's fine. Um, but yeah, guys, so this is her. She is so cute. Ignore the fact that she's stinky, but she is so cute. I absolutely love her. I can't wait to play with her, but we are just going to jump in. I love that I still didn't finish my sentence. So the four sims are just so I can still be a little terrorized, however, still have a good time. We can still not, you know, be too chaotic. But why don't we go ahead and take a steamy shower? Oh, she may have eaten something made with meat. I know, I forgot she was a vegetarian, guys. Completely slipped my mind completely slipped my mind so we're gonna have her take a shower we're also gonna have her use the bathroom and then i think we should get started on love day because basically you know he works most of the time so he's not gonna be home often so this is really just gonna be guadalupe living life it's gonna be guadalupe living life but i don't see maybe we can have her even start a garden but i don't see um the decoration thing so why don't we go ahead and jump into build by mode and we are going to get the decoration boxes or decor boxes whatever they're called i'm not really sure what they're called but we're gonna get that so that we can get started on love day and i want to see what the house will look like with all the decorations let's get it in a cute color purple maybe yeah purple is cute I, i'm down for some purple and we can put it like right there or something we won't get a grill or anything just yet i feel like there's no point because you know oh that's so cute guys that is so cute that is so cute i love i love i love i love oh well so she is now using the toilet let's go ahead and jump back into the game thank you so if you wonder why sometimes my camera gets blurry i have this mod that makes it you know just focus on whatever it's supposed to be focusing on so it's like everything else is blurry except the thing that the camera is focused on so now she's done that um why don't we go ahead and why don't we change this and have them go out on a date why don't he'll take her out to dinner tonight even though he's literally going to be working all day um i don't care we're gonna have um we're gonna have him take her on a date go on a date perfectness perfect oh girl you just cleaned the toilet I'm scared guys, she's throwing up a lot and I'm starting to worry, like what if she, I don't know how pregnant she is, this is her first trimester and she's like dying. So Miss Girl, are you okay? Are you okay? I want her to have a friend or something. So let's look at her needs, she's doing pretty okay right now. Um, why don't we have her, you know, come and look around the property? Are there any people around? Who is this? Oh, guys, look at this. Stop. Who is this? Who is this? More choices. We can't say hi to Cinnamon. I want to come say hi to Cinnamon. Or is that someone's dog? Cinnamon, where are you going? Y'all, I'm literally chasing a dog right now. Wait, stop. I'm getting confused. Where is Cinnamon going? Forget Guadalupe. She'll be fine. We're going on a little adventure. Where is Cinnamon going? Cinnamon, where do you... What the heck? Are you coming back now? What? Oh, it's a fox. I want to name the fox. Well, we are the fox is already named. I, I want this fox, guys. I want this fox. We're going to give the fox tomato sauce. I don't know how that makes sense. I don't know what's going to happen, but that's what we're going to do. That is all I want to do is give a fox tomato sauce. Oh, she has to walk so far. This fox was so far away. Oh, but it's so beautiful here, guys. I forgot what world she's living in, but it's absolutely... Oh my gosh, she's acquaintances. <gasps> guys, stop. 
Guys, stop. Guys, please. Please, the fox. Please, the fox. It is. It is tomato sauce in its mouth. Oh, my gosh. Maybe we can have a pet fox. Stop. Wait, where is he going? Where is he going? He's putting it down. What is he doing? We can chat. Chat with the fox, please. Chat with the fox, please. Our husband's going to come home and he's going to be like, what did you do today? And I'm going to be like, I chatted with the fox. We can sing. Oh my gosh, yes. But what did... Why did he... Okay. What? I'm sorry, what? The fox is leaving me? What? Oh my gosh, she's singing to the fox. We can ex discuss the existence of nine-tailed foxes. Oh my god, he's singing back. Stop. It's the cutest thing I've ever seen. It's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Wait, I'm sorry, who are you? Oh, yeah, I, I guess... I guess she could meet a person. I wanted her to meet the fox. What does the fox say? Wait, hang on. I want you to meet this person. She looks cute. She looks friendly. I kind of like her. I feel like Guadalupe would be friends with her. Yeah, so let's have her come and talk. Oh, it's just so beautiful here, guys. I love everything about it. So our fox is leaving us. Bye, Cinnamon. Um, we'll talk about being a vegetarian, being pregnant as a vegetarian. Maybe that's why she's so pregnant. Maybe vegetarians just get double pregnant. Um, we can share the big news. Hey, if you can't tell, I'm actually pregnant. We just moved here. We're going to have a family. You know, if you hear screaming and crying in the middle of the day, don't worry. It's probably just the kids. Like... This is going to be such a big family. It's the way that I'm kind of excited. I was going to record an episode of... Let's ask them the cloud gaze. I was going to record an episode of the world of sobriety. But I was just like, mm, I don't know. And then the footage got corrupted. So I was like, okay, that's definitely just a you know double sign that i should just play the 100 baby challenge because i was definitely not playing the legacy challenge again so i'm so excited oh don't flirt with her please oh look at them cloud gazing they are so cute we need to give all the sims a makeover though because guadalupe is so cute but all the other ones are kind of kind of meh I mean, I need some skin overlays, if you know what I'm talking about. Maybe some lashes. Maybe not as big as Guadalupe's, but some lashes. I got smaller lashes, too. Um, I want you to share the big news with her, though. You guys can stop stargazing. I want you to tell her, like, hey, we just moved here and I'm pregnant. If you cannot clearly, clearly see. So they're like, oh my god, what? I couldn't know. I had no idea. Aww. See, this is so cute. I want Guadalupe to have a garden. Why don't we go do that? Her husband's about to be home anyway. So actually, let's stop. We're going to stop talking to... What is her name? Manami? Okay, okay, Manami. We're going to have you actually go back home, girl. I need you to go back home. I need you to go back home because your man's about to be home. Jeez, he earned $1,400 today, and he's feeling like he's in the love day spirit. Ooh, but he stinks. Let's have him go ahead and get some hygiene. Um, I'm not going to have them eat early because he's hungry, but I'm not going to have him eat because he's literally about to take her out on a date. So there is no point in doing that, and she's hungry too, so why don't we go ahead and go here? Yeah, please, please get your stuff together. He's going to go ahead and take a shower, and then we'll have him come out here and ask her out on a date for Love Day, his pregnant wife. We kind of need to give her a new outfit. We could do that in this episode. We might do that in this episode. Why don't we actually, before we do that, that's a good idea. I think they're already on, but we're going to do it again anyway. Any, anyway. 
But why don't we go ahead and give her some pregnant outfits? Because Miss Girl's kind of going to be pregnant all the time. So I feel like it's we kind of need to give her something that's going to be appropriate. Yeah? So now we are in Create a Sim. We're going to start with Guadalupe first. Hi, beautiful. How are you? I think I love her hair still, so we're going to leave her hair alone. But let's give her something more, you know, like hey i'm pregnant that's cute i kind of love something as simple as that it comes in different colors too we can do black i don't like that kind of pink that one's cute she likes color guys oh maybe even that one i kind of liked this one but i feel like this is darker than she well it's giving me like grown woman but it's also giving me like fall vibes so why don't we do like I think this one makes it look less like a sweater. Like, this one makes it look more like a, just a regular shirt. And then, do we want to do black jeans? We could do black jeans to match, but I don't know. I feel like she's... Miss Girl. Miss Girl. Maybe these pants? I don't like these pants just be... Or I love these pants, but I don't like that you can't see her shoes. Maybe these? Maybe these... I don't know, maybe we'll stick with these. Because I like what they do with her shirt. Or we could do just some regular leggings. Oh, she's covering up that baby. I wanted her to have a little bit of like midriff though. Do we have any jeans that kind of show her belly but aren't ridiculous, if you know what I'm talking about? Do y'all know what I'm saying? I want like, ugh. these are all high waisted. I don't know, we might just have to stick with what we had for right now. Maybe just do a different color. Oh, I like these. I like these a lot. Let's look at these. What about this one? What about this one? We got... Oh, look how cute these are. Stop. I love these. I feel like she would definitely have some... Some sparkly jeans. I like that a lot. I think that's really cute. And why don't we trade? No, she'd keep those flip flops. They look comfortable, my girl. They look comfortable. Yeah, let's just go darker. Let's go darker on the shoes. Let's look at her formal wear. Ooh, girl, you need to shave them legs. But I feel like she would just wear like a nice long dress. Let's look at our long dresses. It's like a nice long dress. Oh, this these are so cute. I like these a lot, actually. I could definitely see her in something like this. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, but her shoes are blue. I kind of want to stay on theme with the blue. Do they have blue in this color? Oh my gosh, guys. She's absolutely beautiful. Do you think lighter blue? Let's do a lighter blue. Let me guys, let me know in the comments if you want me to go with the darker blue, but I think we should do this lighter blue. Let's look at her active wear. I feel like that's about as good as it should get. Yeah, I feel like that's still good active wear. Her sleep wear, mm, yeah, yeah. Party wear is going to be a definitely not on this. This was cute. I really wanted her to be Iggy Azalea. I really, really did. But maybe something like this. Yeah. Something like this is definitely cuter. Oh, yeah. That's beautiful. Her swim. Simple, simple. Her hot. All right. I still like that. I still like that the way it is. And then last but not least, her cold weather is still good. But this is her new everyday. I love that. And then let's just check on my man, Derek. Because he has a lot of different outfits that I didn't see earlier. So I need to get rid of these. Like, I need him to just have the ones that I gave him. Because he keeps trying to, like, swap into different ones that I did not give him. So that's Derek. Good, guys. I think we can jump back in and have them go on a date. So now we're going to have him. He's going to finish coming out of the shower. Thank you. And he's going to come over here to her. And he's going to come ask her out on a date. And we're going to have them go out to dinner. I think that would be such a cute idea. 
So it's love day, so why don't we kiss her hands, express devotion, go ahead and do all the things we need to do for love day, like give her a rose. Okay, I think that'd be so cute. Talk about moving in together, y'all already live together. Y'all literally already live together. Offer her a rose. Look at them, they're so cute, guys. I love them. We don't need to have that anymore. They can, you know, just compliment her appearance, things like that. Aww, so happy. But I feel like it would go both ways. So I'm gonna have her actually offer him a rose. So that they both get it and they feel good. Oh, you want to share the pregnancy news? Go ahead. I wonder what that looks like. No, you're not going to do it. I want to see what that looks like, guys. Ask to accompany to childbirth? Sure. So he's going to be like, would you come with me to have the baby? I want to see what that... Oh, I will do anything for you, my love. Share pregnancy news. I don't know what that looks like. I've never seen them share their pregnancy news before. So many new things. Stop. Look how cute that is. Oh. Oh, stop. If me and my man aren't this happy when I get pregnant, shoot me. Literally shoot me. Stop. Look how freaking cute they are. Guys. That's the thumbnail. That's the freaking thumbnail right there. Thank you. Oh my gosh. I love them. Oh. Oh, she was like, I was so nervous. Stop. My heart, my heart can't take it. My heart literally can't take it. But I wanted you to offer him a rose. That was so cute, but I wanted you to offer him a rose. Um, so that's what we're gonna have her come over here and do. Come offer him a rose. Romance. Oh, well, no. If he's just gonna eat anyway, that's... You're kind of ruining everything we had planned, Derek. Derek. Honestly, we don't have to go on a date if I can just get her to offer him a rose. But she's not trying to do that. She's not trying to do that, apparently. Okay, yeah. So we're going to have him put that down, please. And then... They're so cute. Whisper seductively. Sure. Not really sure what he's doing, but they are so cute together, guys. Derek really loves her. Like, he really just wants to take care of her and give her the world. And, like, oh, can you ask for more? And all he wants her to do is pop out babies, which would be gross to a reg like a normal, not normal, but, like, to somebody else. But all she wants to do is have babies. So, to her, it's, like, cool, it's whatever. Okay, cool. So then we won't even have them go out, which is going to do wonders for my loading screen. So I'm not even mad about it. But we are going to have her come over here and come make dinner for them. Um, no. Like, not right now, Derek. Please, not right now, Derek. I'm trying to feed you. Why don't we make some soup? I'm in the mood for some soup, guys, especially since I don't feel good right now. Grilled cheese with tomato soup, pot of beetroot soup. Let's do beetroot. That sounds good. That sounds good. So she's going to come over here and she's going to get to cooking. What does he need to do? Practice giving orders? What? How do I do that? I don't even know. Is that something he can do for, like, career? Let me see. 
I wonder if he can practice giving orders on her. That's a little wild. Order to... Oh my gosh. Attention? Can you do that? Stop. We have to do this, guys. I'm sorry. I'm literally terrible. I know, but I don't care. So she is over here, and she is slaving away. Let's have him come do something. Like, I know that he loves her, and he always wants to be with her, but let's give her just a little bit of space, please. I wonder if... I just got this house off the gallery, so I didn't, like, look or put anything in it i don't think i think i literally did not put anything in it so let me look down here do we have a we might not it looks like we don't have a computer or anything which is fine nor do we have a tv that's what i was looking for earlier i was trying to film the intro and like have them go to the tv i think they only have books unless there's a tv in their room is there a tv in their room no so this is just books but that's fine they're different look there are no ipad family okay they actually do stuff with their lives thank you thank you so she's over here did you finish dinner oh i forgot so why don't we go ahead and click and call to meal let's go ahead and bring Derek shaw how pregnant is she guys so she is in her Third, she's in her second trimester already. Okay, so they're gonna come eat dinner together at the dinner table. Maybe they'll talk about their days and things like that. I think they are literally so cute. They are literally so cute. Oh, my heart. And look at their food, guys. I'm gonna have her talk to him real fast. Let's say like blow him a kiss just blow him a kiss real cute but look at look at their food oh my gosh that looks so good like i'm hungry right now <laughs> are you guys hungry right now i'm hungry right now i literally just ate and i'm hungry right now but that soup looks so good always on the phone girl so she's gonna go ahead and make them some dinner and now that she's finished eating we can go to the bathroom or whenever she finished eating it looks like we get a lot of soup let me put this soup up actually let me look at the soup let me just look at the soup in all its glory hang on y'all hang on y'all look at the soup mmm that is so good oh my gosh that is so good so she went to the bathroom. I'm gonna have her come clean this stuff up. Okay, no. I'm gonna have you come clean this stuff up, please. That is your job, your J-O-B. And then I think we can just have them go to bed. Yeah, let's go upstairs and we can have them go to bed. Let me see right here. And they can literally, let me click go to bed with oh let's have them pillow fight i think that would be literally the cutest thing ever you can't tell me that's not the cutest thing ever after she finishes cleaning this stuff up just use the trash can right there please thank you guadalupe is probably the first thing that i have that's not bugged that just does what she's supposed to do thank god for guadalupe they're gonna go as she's like hey do you want to have a pillow fight and she's like oh my gosh literally yes they're such children together oh finally like a good relationship in the sims i feel like normally my sims always have like these super hard you know hard to deal with lives like no can we just be happy can we really just be happy oh i have a pillow fight what oh my gosh look at them at their old age at their big age just kids raising kids that is literally the cutest thing ever that is honestly probably the cutest thing ever okay so she oh my gosh she's beating him up i am so weak she was like i've been waiting for this one y'all please go to bed please go to bed oh my gosh no read to the baby yes i'm gonna have him go to sleep I'm going to have her read to the baby because that sounds, wait, 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 hang on, hang on, I'm missing it, I think I'm missing it, 
Are you asking him to? Oh, are they gonna do it together? Please, my heart can't take it. My heart can't take it. What are you gonna do? Please, my heart can't take it. Oh my gosh, guys, they're actually the cutest things ever. Look at them reading to the bit. Guys, I think Miss Girl is dead. Oh, it's him. Like, oh, wait, stop, 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 stop. Did you see? Did you see? He put his he put his hand on her on her um on her head. Stop, guys. My heart can't. He's caressing her. Stop. My heart can't take it. Oh my god. My heart can't take it. It can't take it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm literally having a cuteness overload right now. I'm literally having a cuteness overload right now. They're both going to go to sleep. Oh, and they're going to snuggle while they sleep, please. <laughs> Guys, I'm actually sobbing. I'm sobbing. They are literally the cutest thing ever. I think this is going to be... Oh my gosh, guys, I don't want to say it, but I think this might be my favorite Let's Play. And it's the fact that this is the Let's Play that's going to make me struggle. And it's literally my favorite Let's Play. Like, I'm going to be on the edge of my seat trying to take care of all of these freaking kids. And I'm just like, oh my god, but cuteness. And I know the kids are going to be so cute. And I want to get the mod that's like um, the buy option. That's like it's the kids bouncing chair please oh my gosh i'm screaming i'm screaming i don't know i think i'm literally going into cuteness overload right now but i think that's kind of it guys i don't know i'm gonna keep this episode kind of short and sweet i'm having cuteness overload and i hope that you guys are too but that is actually going to be the very first episode of the 100 baby challenge so if you guys enjoyed go ahead and like this video if you want to see the second episode comment down below okay so we can get it out for you guys don't forget to subscribe for more hit that bell to be notified every single time that we post so i love you guys and i will see all of you oh my heart my heart my heart my heart my heart my heart okay uh, i will see all of you guys in the next video so thank you so much for watching bye friends look at you